now finished exploring Shonbun Palace, so we're now heading to this place, which is listening to classical music. So we're gonna be going there in a while. So I'm just showing you, since we are in Vienna, we are at the heart of the city of music. So of course, you know, it's imperative for us to like really try and experience how it is to be listening classical music, like a proper one. So. That's the next one that we will be doing in a couple of hours. Hermano, where are we now? So, we are in one place that is in, it's been in our bucket list for yes. so long. It's called uh, Music Verein, mm -hmm. the house of the music mm -hmm. here in Vienna. And it's a place where the Philharmonica, the Viela Philharmonica, uh, every year on the 1st of January, they do the concert of the New Year's. And it's uh, it's incredible. When you see it in the, ins in the inside, it's fantastic. And the, the music that you can hear there is like the most famous classical music pieces that, um, that you can hear. Like you always hear all these famous musical pieces in like these nice recordings. So here you can listen to it in person. So we're ready to come in now. So there you go. It's the first time for me, like entirely the first time for me to like witness a real uh, classical uh, music spectacular show. So, it's a bucket list. Uh, I think it's very imperative that you have to try at least one of them. And we're very excited. We're gonna come in in a few minutes inside the hall. So, guys, classical music shows here in Vienna is a big thing. Can you imagine we were here on the queue and see how much, how many people are here wanting to like see and witness a classical musical show? So, definitely, <laughs> I think this is a big thing here. Definitely. You come to Vienna, this is compulsory. Yes. Mandatory. Definitely. We're now on our second day here in Vienna and yesterday we've been to Schönbrunn Palace and also we've witnessed a classical music show here in Vienna and the next big thing that you have to like really see here in Vienna is the most famous landmark which is the St. Stephen's Cathedral which is behind me as you can see how remarkable this landmark here in Vienna is imagine the mosaic roof it looks like the St. Vitus Cathedral in Prague where we've been and yeah so be with us guys let's come inside After St. Stephen's Cathedral, we're now here in Hofburg Palace. So Hofburg Palace is very iconic as well. Okay, you can just imagine you can see actually how lavish this architectural style is. But this one houses actually the imperial apartments of Maria Teresa and also CC Museum and also the famous Spanish horse riding school here in Vienna. So I don't know if we can come inside because we don't have much time, but admiring the outside structure is an experience in itself.
Right guys, there you go. We've finished our uh, adventures here in Vienna. I hope you've enjoyed a little bit of information about Vienna and you know, thank you so much for being with us on this adventure. If you made this adventure fun and exciting, it can be your adventures. Bye!